So in this video, I'll be showing you how to brighten the shadows in your picture without destroying the highlights. I'll be using this picture for the example and I've left the link for it in the description. So I need to make a selection of the shadows, but it's actually easier to select the highlights first and then invert the selection to get the shadows. So I'm going to the channel studio. I'm clicking the three dots on composite red. Then load to pixel selection. So now that's selected the highlights and to invert it, I need to go over to the selections persona. Then I'm going to commands, which is the three dots and I'm clicking invert selection. So now the shadows are selected, but I need to make that into a separate layer. So I'm going back to the photos persona. I'm going to commands, then pasteboard, then copy merged, then back to commands, pasteboard, and paste. So if I go to the layer studio, you can see there's the original layer and the shadows layer. So then I can deselect and just make sure you're on the move tool and not the view tool, which is the little hand, or the options won't come up. Then to brighten the shadows, I need to change the blend mode. So I'm clicking on the three dots and then I can change the blend mode here. And I think screen or add work the best for this, but I'm going to put the blend mode on screen. So you can see that's now brightened up the shadows. And if you want to brighten it up even more, you can always duplicate that layer. And if it's too much, you can bring the opacity down. 